their stories. In the days of prehistory, we humans felt the need to share our knowledge and experiences with others. It is in our nature to share what we have learned with those around us and with those that come after us. This is how we teach one another and better ourselves as a species. What began 40,000 years ago as cave paintings and oral traditions passed down through generations evolved into written words, theater, audio, video, and even interactive social, social media. My name is Abby Richter and I have stories to tell. As an adopted child, I see my pets as family. We were all chosen and loved no matter what. Regardless of what happens during my pet's life, we will still love them. At eight and a half years old, I began writing a series of books about my pets. Each book focuses on an aspect of overcoming hard times through love and support. Each book was a number one bestseller on Amazon. The books are not great literary works. The books became popular because of their honesty and life lessons people were able to take from them. Children love them because they are stories about animals. Adults enjoy them because of their stories about overcoming hardship and because they find them inspirational for their own writing aspirations. The books have even been used to read to the elderly and disabled as a means of keeping them reading and engaged. That's why I write stories. Stories are much more than a transfer of information. They are a communication of knowledge and experiences that improve both the lives of the listeners and storytellers. The sharing of stories creates conversation that help both readers and writers to achieve more. The greatest storytellers of the world, from Shakespeare to Mark Twain, to our friends at the street at Pixar, inspire us to imagine and create. The internet allows us to share our stories through blogs, websites, and perhaps through one of the greatest modern forms of storytelling and knowledge transfer, TED Talks. We are all storytellers. Some may say the internet has made us the generation of impatience and instant gratification, the end of the age of listening and storytelling. Nothing could be further from the truth. Publishing stories was once only available to the wealthy. Now it is within reach of anyone with a computer. There are 300 hours of video posted on YouTube every minute and nearly 5 billion videos viewed every day. That's 5 billion, and it's not all music and cat videos. YouTube has become the place for people to share their lives and their stories with the world. The term going viral is proof of, of how anyone can influence millions with their story. So tell your story. Share your knowledge with those around you and with the world beyond. Your words may touch someone, become the foundation for another, even greater story, and an even greater story beyond that. The world is connected and interconnected in ways our cave painting ancestors could not possibly have imagined. Our words can change lives for the better. This is the most amazing time in history to be alive. Be part of the story.